Hello, this is Mike Roslog, Product Manager for Rad Studio. I just wanted to give you a quick highlight in this video of some of the features that you may not be aware of inside of Code Insight. So let's go ahead and start this off. So I'm going to say File New, and we're going to create a new VCL application. Once we have the VCL application, I'm going to come in and drop a button from my tool palette. Now in my tool palette, if I double click on this button, I'm going to want to set the caption. So let's say button one dot caption. Now as you can see, I've got my code insight dialog up. If I want to, I could come in here and sort by name. So this puts it in alphabetical order, or I can sort by scope. And then we, I'm going to show you how you can also use the history to get the most common types. So again, right mouse click inside and you can say sort by name or sort by scope. So let's go ahead and remove this. I'm going to go back into my tools, options, go into my editor, and then I want to go into my code completion right here. I want to turn on auto parentheses, which is already turned on by default, and I want to turn on the history. So as you can see, we have history turned on, and I'm going to hit the OK button. Inside of my product now, I'm going to say button one dot caption, and I'm going to say colon equals wow. Then we're going to come back out to the designer, and I'm going to drop another button from the tool palette onto my form. On this one, I'm going to double click on it, and I'm going to say button two dot and notice that it automatically brings me up to caption because that was the last thing I used. So it comes up with the most used items for your specific object or the specific control that you're using. So these are some of the features that you may not be aware of inside of Rad Studio XE, and I just wanted to pass it along to you. Hope you have a great day. Bye-bye.